I graduated in 2003 and I am a proud alumnus. At this point in my career, Shenandoah has helped me to create the foundation that I've needed as an actor and a performer. Some of the most rewarding and uh, beautiful accomplishments that I've been able to have in my career have been performing on Broadway, uh, performing on the Tony Awards in Pippin and Anything Goes, as well as Tootsie, and uh, just being able to experience the journey of the height of what musical theater is. Also creating and producing my own shows and being able to present them to the world, touring across the country with the shows and just being able to present a life that, that, that I knew that I wanted to have. You know, when you come into school and you're trying to figure out what you want, you have a goal of what you want. And it's just about building the structure and Shenandoah conservatory literally gave me the building blocks that I needed to go to the next level to have those experiences. So I'm really grateful for each of those. And as time has progressed on, I've been able to teach and learn what I needed to, to share with this world. So I'm really grateful for all of it. I'm back at SU today to instruct some of the students who are in the dance program as well as the music theater program because I think with some of the journeys that I've had, some of the lessons that I've learned, I'm able to kind of at least just give some kind of hope and inspiration to people who feel like they're stuck or feel like, you know, they're in school and they don't know, specifically after the pandemic, don't know where they want their focus to go. And specifically for people of color to let them know that we can survive and do great things. I have a nonprofit called Black Broadway Men that celebrates, educates, and motivates Black men of the Broadway and theater community by creating unity with each other, finding strength through educational opportunities, and embracing the legacy of those that have come before us because we're the legacy for those that come after us. And so the more that we continue to share our life stories and experiences, the more we'll be able to inspire those and let people know that you can do it too because life is great. And the more that you continue to take it by the, by the horns, no matter what you're facing and what adversity you go through, uh, me being here is a testament from Norfolk, Virginia, lets people know that you, know, you can achieve anything that you dream of if you just focus.